Hello everyone, so today was a very busy day. I am heading now to the office. So I went for some hardware shopping for my project. I have a project in Malacca. We are supposed to deliver it this week. So I went for some shopping for the project. And today I got my Nike shoes. This is my first ever Nike shoes. So I'm very happy about it. It just got shipped today. Yeah. So now I'm exiting the bridge going to Jalan Pera. It's a very beautiful road and a lot of skyscrapers. This is Manara Bankistan. The building after that, which you saw it like kind of boxy thing, that's my office building. And the tower are opposite to it. This is where the new WeWork office is located. I think at 16th floor somewhere there. Is it 16 or I can't remember. Yeah, that one. Just open I think last month in February. Here we go. This is the view. Let some natural light in there. Hello everyone. So I decided to make my first vlog. Uh, I'm going to tell uh, I will try every day to record a, a short video or maybe every week I will combine uh, the best interesting things in my day or in my week. Uh, I'm still experimenting, I don't know how. So the, basically it will be the story of a Syrian entrepreneur in Kuala Lumpur in Malaysia. So how's my day, what is my challenges, what I do basically. So maybe this will inspire some of you to start your own business. Maybe you can see what, how's my daily life, what, does, what do I do, so things like that. I don't know, maybe you'll find it interesting, maybe you'll find it boring. But I think, I think let's try and see, because you never know. Maybe this thing will break the internet, maybe no one will care. But for me, I'm doing it for myself, because I feel I'm kind of more productive this way. Like I feel I'm uh, like someone watching over me sometimes. Uh, so I do. Uh, focus more on work. Uh, those, you know, social media or stuff which sometimes interrupt you and interrupt your focus. Uh, now I, I, I think I start to ignore them and just focus on work and finish what I have to do every day. So let's see how it's, go it's going to turn to be. Uh, yeah. So we'll see you again. Uh, maybe. Okay. I know they didn't script this, but I, I was just tell you a little bit maybe about me. So I have uh, this company called Wonderland Technologies. And what we do, I, I like to call what we do or what I do is a sci-fi solutions provider. So I'm here in my office uh, nearby KLCC area in my small office. It's about 600 square feet. It's a pretty small office, but I think it does a good job. Uh, right now, I'm almost doing everything by myself. I used to have some stuff working for me, but things get rough, so I decided, okay, I will do whatever it takes for me to survive and make uh, my business growing and make my business surviving, because even surviving was a challenge, because many things went in the economy, especially in 2018, but I think things improving. 
2019 seems more promising. Uh, so I will show you a short uh, tool. It's very, very simple tool. So basically, this is my desk. This is the meeting table. This is where I do startup zone interviews. And okay, let me come this way. And this is uh, what you call a hologram display. It's for a client. We are finalizing the work. Mm, this is like a bookcase. And here you can see a one prototype of hologram. And you can see some desks. And these are the lights which I used to shoot. And we are back to me. I mean, to my desk. You are back to me. So, yeah. So what I do, I do hologram display, I do augmented reality, virtual reality. Uh, I also start to venture last year to artificial intelligence. My company started back in 2016 while I used to have a job. So I was juggling the job and my company. And actually I started with my company uh, by investing part of my salary every month so maybe in the first month i registered the company the second month i i paid the deposit for the office the third month i bought some furniture the fourth month i think or maybe something like that i paid the deposit to open the bank account then the fifth month i start to build my interactive screen then like after summer i built my first uh, prototype of hologram then the second one yeah so things like that until i went full time so one day my boss you know i am um, because i participated in an exhibition so he saw some videos online so he told me oh you're running your own business i said yeah so he said well maybe you can't do that you have to focus so he gave me an option either to continue working but to give up on my dreams or to focus on my business and my dreams so of course i chose to focus on my dreams because i thought i don't want to build someone else's dreams i want to build my own dreams even if i fail at least i know i tried so it was tough in the beginning but eventually i survived now more than a year a year and a half almost a year and a half so i think it's good i'm glad i made that decision um, i think i'm happy i'm happier now than before maybe i make less money but i'm happier so i will tell you every day a little bit about, about what i do and i hope you can relate to that so that's it thank you bye I just came home, had dinner with the family now. I'm going to the mall to pick up my glasses. Going to the shop. Then got my glasses. So let's go back. Taking my daughter to the park. Hello, Amina. Hello, Amina. Hello, Amina. What? Hi, me and Amira. Mm-hmm. <laughs>